What's up, everyone, and welcome to another very special episode from Ranji.com and the Garage Sale Transformers Toy Finders, or GSTF2 for short. This is the new show, and today we are doing, uh, well, is it, it's an Is It Difficult to Transform episode, season four, I forgot the episode number, I, I think I even got wrong, but basically, I, I got these boxes in the mail from Amazon. It actually, it was one order, but they came in two separate shipments. Um, I've already pre-opened them, so I'm gonna reveal to you what's inside. Let's put them out of the frame. This is the first shipment that I got. Yes, it's cyber for stuff. One stuff changer, but I, I got these for fairly cheap. <clears throat> so these are normally 15 Canadian each. I got them for less than 10, maybe 9, maybe 7.50, maybe, maybe even 8 bucks in a bit. Let's just say maybe, so it should be $30 retail, but I probably got it about $16. So that's more than 40% uh, off. And then, and they're also on sale. These are also on sale at Walmart for ten dollars. So these are even cheaper than Walmart. So that, so I, I thought I'd get them because they're cheaper. I, I, somebody will probably sell this online on Facebook, like um, as an old toy, uh, like like a parent selling an old toy of their kid. And then it'll be five bucks, three bucks each. But anyway, I got these now, so it's pretty cool. Transformers, of course, these are Transformers Cyberverse Adventures. Bumblebee Cyberverse Adventures. One Step Changers, Self Force Bumblebee, basically Gray Bumblebee, and Wheeljack. So I'm finally, I'm glad to get a Wheeljack uh, from the Cyberverse line. Hopefully they do a, maybe a, um, a deluxe version of him sometime in the future. And then I also got this one. So this is Transformers. Again, Bumblebee Cyberverse Adventures. I think this is Trooper Class. Yep, Trooper Class. Megatron. He's basically deluxe uh, in height, 5.5 inches, but Trooper Class is actually in the close to the, well, in between a, a deluxe and a Voyager price point. This is normally 35 Canadian. I got this for just $11, I think. So man, that's, that's big. So I thought, why not? I mean, I wasn't going to get Megatron because I already have a couple of uh, Cyberverse Megatron figures, <clears throat> but I can't pass up on a really good deal. So in total, these three are probably just 30 Canadian dollars. The price of a deluxe, so I could have just gotten another deluxe instead of these three guys. But man, I, I'm as you guys know, if you've been following the channel, I am I, I, I'm collecting the Cyberverse line. So well, not all of it, um, but yeah, as much as I can for cheap. So let's just get right to. Uh, well, let's take a look at what's on the package first. This is Stealth Force Bumblebee. Nothing really to see. One step changer, and on the back, one step. But he's he's probably two steps. But uh, so yeah, I <coughs> there is of course uh, yellow bumblebee. I'm not interested in that. I'm not really that interested in one step changers, especially these <sighs> crazy looking ones. But I have it. There it is. And then there's wheeljack, same banana, different uh, color. Oh, <laughs> uh, one step changer. Uh, but yeah. Oh, that looks like a different transformation from Bumblebee and, and that that's that's cool and then he so Bumblebee comes with a stinger type of weapon thingy and that's what they call it in Cyberverse and Wheeljack comes with a shoulder cannon pretty cool yep Wheeljack nice all right and last but not least Megatron right here he has battle call he has voice activated voice activated uh, thingy I don't know how that works yet Hello, Megatron. No, the, uh, you can see the electronics there. That's pretty cool. I mean, that's really what makes this a little more expensive than usual. But oh man, look at those accessories. So, uh, yeah, he's 11 steps. Wow, that's uh, and he's a ruthless leader. Let's let's see what their functions are. Did they say they just say uh, no, nothing. Just says just says heroic Autobot. Okay, whatever. All right. So, um, and here's Megatron. Anything else on the back? Nope. That's about it. Evil Decepticon. <sighs> let's just unbox these guys already. Uh, let's start with Wheeljack. Actually, let's let's just free them, free them all from their stasis pods, so that we can get all the packaging out of the way. Okay, there you go, and. Oops, and there's Megatron. Oh boy, he's gonna be tough to get out of there. I, I probably should open the box first. And you can open the box from the side. There you go. 
and then we have there it is. Oh, there's a flap there, keep them together. Just pull out the bubble packaging. Oh, that's a lot of accessories. So, man, 11 bucks, man, on sale from Amazon. Go check out, well, Amazon.ca, Canadian Amazon. So it's, it's gotta be different for you guys in just a whole lot more better Transformers deals on Amazon US. Uh, I do monitor that too. I, I might just pull the trigger on one of those purchases, but <clears throat> I got other you know, expenses, so I'm not just really pulling the trigger those um, but man, th these are pretty cool accessories i think i, I don't i don't really want these things uh i just want him <clears throat> to have this what do you call this thing fusion cannon oh boy is it difficult to get out of the package oh there you go uh, give him his cannon Oh, nice, nice, nice uh, Decepticon logo right there. The face is very cyberverse-y. Um, not the greatest Megatron, but man, I mean, you guys might <clears throat> take a dig on cyberverse, but these cyberverse is gonna bring more uh, fans into the fandom, younger fans, and that's that's important. We need younger fans. Anyway, uh, let's. I'll, I'll transform these guys first. So I, I don't know how they transform of course i feel like you're supposed to oh there you go just pop open that one um and then just pull everything back oh wow that's not exactly one step there's two and but but that that looks pretty cool and that's that's kind of um scales with megatron let's put megatron this side just because man, and man look at that wheeljack face it doesn't look like wheeljack Crazy guys, but otherwise the figure looks fairly nice for what it's worth. <laughs> but on the back, man, <laughs> crazy. All right, there's that. And, and so yeah, I, I'll transform him back again later, and then trying to figure this out. So it looks like we. Oh, how does the one step here work? So these are which ones are his feet? Um, how does this work again? Uh, Oh man, is it difficult to transform? Okay, I sorry, I, I looked at the instructions. So you're supposed to do that. And then what? And then what? Oh, and then rotate. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, let's do that. Let's do both feet together. That, that's pretty cool. Check that out, man. Oh man, I oh there you go. That 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 was pretty cool, but the end result is not so uh cool. But yeah, there there he is. There's Bumblebee. He, he looks very weird, but it is a robot. <laughs> sure, for kids. And there's uh yeah, I mean the alt the alt modes are uh, aren't bad. So there's Bumblebee and. Uh, and Wheeljack gets Megatron. So there they are, group shot, photo, photo. Let's transform these guys now back into their vehicle modes. As I transform, um, what's his name? Megatron into his vehicle mode as well. Oh, this thing somehow, does it? Oh, it just extends, it doesn't really pop out. All right, whatevs. And we're gonna do this, fold the knees, the feet back or down. And we're just going to pull this over. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I love it. oh it, it rolls very nicely so that's pretty cool let's do that to bumblebee a little more complicated if you ask me but it's oh wow how do i oh why uh oh oh wow okay i don't get it but there it is oh and he won't close what's going on Oh, there it is so it's not straightforward one step here <laughs> requires a lot of finagling but otherwise yeah that's yeah finicky alt mode wheeljack's a better alt mode but he's a little smaller ah uh, man th th this kind of sucks but 
it is what it is. So there they are running away from Megatron. And now let's transform Megatron. Um, it's probably if, oh, look at that. Okay, let's straighten his arms. Probably need to straighten out and this one pop out. Then we are going to, oh wow. Uh, what do I need to do here? Oh, I get it. This thing, there you go, that opens up. I feel like I've seen this transformation before. And then the whole thing will fold. I feel like the deluxe transforms this way as well. Um, oops, uh, we need to rotate something here. Uh, uh, oh, oh, okay. I, his arms probably need to go to the back. Oh yeah, and, and they tap together, okay. Like that. And then these things will... Oh, they, it, ro it rotates. And then now you can do the normal thing, the usual stuff. So it's, it's pretty cool. Uh, 11 steps, doesn't feel like 11 steps, but that's that. Now, the question is how, where do we... How do we tab these guys in? So I, I see a tab there and a tab hole. Looks like those should go together, but it is easier said than done. I I don't get it. And then where does his, where do his arms go? I don't get it. I have to look at the. <clears throat> Packaging. Oh, it, it looks like man, that that's. It looks like there should be a panel here. Are we, oh, there it is. All right, nice, nice. Again, eleven Canadian dollar, maybe seven U.S. dollar, or eight, eight, maybe eight or nine U.S. dollars. That that's not. This is not bad. Now I just need to pop him in. If I can, I don't know how. Oh, okay. I, I see two pegs there, round pegs and peg holes on his shoulder. So we definitely have to line those up. I think that's, and, oh, and then this one folds out. Okay, man, th this is not easy, but I mean, it's not difficult to figure out. So answer to our question, is it difficult to transform? Is a no, but man, this is not an easy execution nothing easy and man it's tough to line them up let's pull that out first oh there you go pop that in there and there you go otherwise once you've done it it's a uh, pretty nice and solid figure I think or that's what it's looking like and there you go and there you go and then pop two arms together and then close this up oops Oh, okay. Yeah, that, that's how it works. Those are actually um, upward facing tabs. Do that. Do that. And then finally pop this in there. And there they are. Okay, take a photo. And then take a photo of them there. Take a photo of them there. Boo boo. And that's it, pretty cool, pretty cool. So now transform them all back into their robot modes. Huh. So just pull this over and back all the way Ooh, back. Actually pull this out as well. And then all the way back and then it should kind of hook into place there and then pull this out and it will snap into place. Pull out the four the arms so that, yeah, yeah that, that, anyway. That's that's not a bad wheel jack except for the head. It's not doesn't even look like the head on the packaging. But um, anyway, let's do this one. I don't know how it works, but we do that, do that, and okay, there it is. I think that's it. And pull out his um, forearms. And there he is. That's your bumblebee, Cyberverse bumblebee. Bumblebee, Bumblebee, 
and Megatron. Pretty nice. This was pretty nice. Uh, and again, it is a basically warrior slash deluxe sized figure. So that's that is very cool. Oh, you have to untab that first. And then untab on the shoulder, untab on the side, tab on the shoulder on the and on the side, and then we're going to pull this back, tuck this in, push it back in, and we're gonna rotate at the waist, and then close this up, close this up, and just position his arms. Oh wow, I just what was that? Gee whiz. Oh okay, it's it's nothing. Anyway, there's that, and then pop this in and there is Megatron that's that's a pretty nice Megatron I still don't know how to do the voice activation thing hey Megatron Megatron um how do I do it voice activated play hello pop I feel like there, there might be a switch somewhere oh there it is Megatron hello I think that's it it just lights up. Hello, Megatron. And then, yeah, when when you pop in all his his uh, translucent accessories, he will light up in all sorts of ways. And that's just really it. So there's there's a switch up here on his shoulder. So that was actually a an LED light. So anyway, pretty cool. I mean, again, thirty five Canadian dollar figure. I got it for eleven and a bit. All these in total less than um, thirty Canadian dollars before tax basically the price of a deluxe figure so not a bad haul um and this was fun i uh but yeah and that being said that's about it for this episode of rangi.com in the garage sale transforms toy finders or gstf2 for short this is the new show this is the show where we try to answer the question is it difficult to transform we also did a mail call new haul where we on Revealed, unbox, and package these three bots: Transformers, Bumblebee, Cyber Reverse Adventures, One Step Changer, uh, Stealth Force, Bumblebee, One Step Changer, Wheeljack, and Trooper Class Megatron. The answer to the question: Is it difficult to transform? Is of course a no. That being said, we hope you liked this episode, and if you did, don't forget to hit like, comment, and subscribe. Also, please follow us on the social media channels: from on Patreon, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Last but not least, please share this video with your friends, your family, your loved ones, and everybody you know, including your enemies, because they might start to like you again. As Alphonsus Prime would always say. And until next time, Autobots rub up and rule out.